Hey guys, so today I wanted to do a video about the Open University. Sorry, bit of light coming this way, but I wanted to do a video about the Open University and it's just a chat, uh, sort of like an update, but also don't want it to be a negative video because it won't be, but it's the negative side of it in a way. So I might title it something like, do I regret my Open University? Something along those lines. And the truth is, I don't regret it, quick answer, but I am very tired of it and I'm on my fourth year, the last day of November of 2019, I still have this year until June and then another more year to finish my degree and to be honest, I'm very tired of it and I just want it gone. That doesn't mean I regret it because I do not regret it, I love a lot of the stuff that I'm learning. I regret doing mathematics and physics because the mathematics side I just don't like, I don't enjoy it and the thing is for me when I started this journey my life was very different and this is a whole another topic but my life was very different. I was single, I was living on my own, I was an intern, I had no career at that point, I was doing nothing, I had nothing going on in my life other than the fact that I moved to London. And at that point, um, I thought if I study this, I could go and work in the field, I could do something scientific, even if it's not a proper like astrophysics job, I could mix communications with science, do something along those lines. I even had other dreams that I thought I could do. And the truth is, a lot changes in four years. At the point that I'm in my life right now, I know that I won't be able, 95% likely that I won't do anything that has to do with science, physics, maths, nothing of that sort. Because at the point that I'm in my life right now, I have a job that I've had career progression since then. And the job that I'm right now is a lot better in terms of pay than what I would have if I changed career paths. As I said, at the point that I'm in my life, I met my boyfriend, we bought this flat in August, I have mortgage, I have things to pay, I have uh, other things that I want in my life in a few years that I need that money for. It. So in that sense, I can't just, you know, if I was still single, living on my own, doing nothing, I would say, you know what, I don't care, I'll start over and work in a field that I prefer. But uh, the point that I'm in my life, that doesn't look likely. So. Uh, the Open University degree that I'm doing, Mathematics and Physics, I love the physics side. This year I'm taking the Astrophysics module and let me tell you, I live for that module. That's what I wanted since the start. I love it. I read it and I enjoy it. I love it. It's, it's amazing. The maths one. <laughs> no, let me just scrap that one. It doesn't exist. I just want to pass it and move on. I love the things that I'm learning and I'm very... Uh, glad that I started the journey to learn the things because as I've mentioned many times I tried to learn those things on my own beforehand uh, internet books stuff like that but I just didn't know what I didn't know basically so I couldn't learn because I didn't know the stuff that I needed to know first to understand the rest so I'm very glad that I did the Open University in that sense because now I know the things that I know if that makes sense and I'm very glad that I have that knowledge and I'm very happy that I have that knowledge because it's something that I've wanted to have for years and something that I was lacking uh, it's also something it gives me something to do in a sense but it's too much at this point that's why I'm so done with it in a way yeah it's something fun to do because I find it fun to learn those things the cost side I do regret in a sense I think it's too much money for a degree that I'm gonna do nothing with but I do understand that I had to pay that money to get the rest of the things that I've gotten but again I do regret the money part in a sense because yeah it is it is expensive and if you don't think you're gonna work in the field then it's just wasted money really but uh, because it's so expensive if it was the price of a Spanish university degree then I wouldn't regret the money side because it's not that much but because it's the open university it's very pricey I wonder if I would have preferred to study with the version of the open university in Spain which is UNED but I do like that I'm learning things in English, if that makes any sense, probably not. So I enjoy it, but at this point, I just, uh, the first few years I was quite worried about, you know, going to the exam and not getting the marks and not getting the most out of it, not being able to get a uh, first degree uh, or a tier one. At this point, even though I still want 
a 2-1 or a first, which I won't get. But a 2-1, uh, still possibly an option. Even though I still want a 2-1, I feel like that's not my priority anymore. I want to finish it and because I don't, I really don't think I'm going to do anything with it. I'm not as concerned with the marking of it, if that makes sense. But yeah, at this point, I'm very tired of it. I feel like when I do my physics one, I'm ready to learn and I want to read it and stuff. When I have to do my mathematics modules, I just... I push them to the side as much as I can. I just want to finish that part. Uh, I still have to get... Think about the two modules that I want to take next year, which to be fair, I don't want any of them. Those are my thoughts at the minute. If you're doing an open university because you want to work in that field, amazing, you'll love it, probably. And you'll get something more out of it if you're doing it like me for the knowledge. Know that it's a very, very lengthy process and towards the last third of it, you're gonna feel very done with it. I just, I feel like I'm not... And they've also changed the way that they mark assignments and how the whole score of the whole module goes. To be fair, the assignments that I'm doing count for nothing, so I just feel like I'm not putting the effort in because I know that it's not even going towards my overall grade, so I don't care. Only the exam counts and then there's a project for the astrophysics module, but I feel like because it doesn't count my assignments, I'm just, you know, doing whatever. I know I need to get to a certain level, which I know I'm getting anyway. So I feel like I'm just, you know, leaving things blank because I'm like, well, I'm not gonna bother anymore. Instead of trying hard, even though it doesn't count. So those are my thoughts, getting very tired of it, but at the same time, very glad that I'm doing the whole thing and that I'm learning the things that I'm learning. But I just wanted to share those thoughts with you guys. Uh, I don't know how many of you, there's a few people who actually uh, have told me they do the same um, degree that I'm doing with the Open University. So I would love to know your thoughts on the course. I would love to know what you think. Also, I feel like uh, level one and level two were very similar. I mean, there was a slight progression in the difficulty of what you're learning and the amount of stuff that you need to get done. But for level three, I just feel like it's a whole, a whole completely different level. I just don't have time to do all the things that I need to do that also count for nothing, basically. So it's just very difficult to find the motivation to do it. I just don't want to do it. when. You know, I prefer to film videos, I prefer to watch YouTube, I prefer to do other things that I want to do with my time. Other than um, doing the Open University stuff that I need to do and knowing that the exams, especially for my math scores, knowing that the exam is 100% of my grade for that module is just very demotivating. I don't do amazing at exams because I get stressed with not having enough time and I do check things too many times because I'm concerned that I'm not getting the grade and then I lose more time doing that and I just don't do as well on exams that I do on assignments so I just feel like I'm just not gonna do well on that one anyway so I'm just like why am I gonna bother the whole year when I know that I'm not gonna do well on it or as well as I would like so on that sense I'm just like I just want to pass it and then it's done I just want it to be 2021 summer 2021 be done with it be like cool done it learned it amazing i'll keep buying books keep learning astrophysics and other physics things mathematics done with you for life <laughs> because honestly that side of the whole course is so frustrating i thought it would really help me understand the physics side more and it has until one point but i feel like for the modules that i'm taking this year and the ones that I will take next year. The mathematics module has nothing to do with the physics one. They're completely different things. And it's just not helping me on the other one. So I just, I just don't know why I'm doing it. And yeah, that's... I've lost a lot of the motivation that I had to begin with. Again, that's partially because my life has changed so much since. But at the same time, very glad that I'm doing it. And overall, very glad of where my life has taken me. So I'm quite happy about that. And just wanted to share my thoughts with you guys. If you guys have enjoyed the video, if you have any comments, please let me know in the comment section below. Subscribe to the channel if you haven't subscribed yet. And I will see you guys later with another video. Bye!